Hey, what's up guys? It's your pal Dr. V here with another Motu review. Today I'm going to be taking a look at the Mattel Creations exclusive Masterverse Snout Spout. Alright, great box art to begin with. Different uh, than the typical Masterverse boxes, but uh, I really kind of prefer the shoebox look. Uh, and again, the artwork is absolutely beautiful. Let's open them up and see what's inside. Very nice. Slightly different than the front. All right, open that up. Very nice. Look at that. It looks great. Let's go ahead and take them out of the package here. Comes out and, uh, huh. I guess his accessories are in here. Snout Spout here we're with Water Blasting Firefighter. Yep. And just like we thought, accessories. I'll set those aside for now. And let's finish taking a look at the figure. We will undo these dreaded ties. And through the power of editing, boom, there we go. Here's Snout Spout and all of his accessories out of the package. Uh, he comes with some gripping fists, two closed fists, uh, the water effect, which is actually a really um, nice, clear, translucent kind of aqua blue. Really, not really nice. Uh, this axe, which is just absolutely giant and oversized, but would totally fit for a big character like him. His uh, water backpack that does have some uh, somewhat, you know, translucent canisters in the back to indicate his water level. These two pegs are for, and this one are for the uh, next set of accessories. His hoses. Can't be a firefighter without a hose, right? So let's go ahead and put them together and see how he looks. So we're gonna put the short hose on top here and gonna put the longer hoses on the bottom there we go and uh, now we'll attach it to the back of snout spout which by the way this figure is really impressive just straight out of the box put them together like so these two pegs go on his back just like that and then the short hose plugs into the back of his head. Just like that. And then the longer hoses attach right here. All right, let's give him his axe and water effect. Sorry about the wind, guys. I was just such a nice day outside. I wanted to try to do a review outside. And we'll put his water effect in his trunk. Now his trunk is really cool because it has uh, articulations in, in every section. So we've got one right there, two up and down, of course, rotates three, third section right there, fourth section, Fifth section. Yeah, so there's five parts of his trunk and they're all articulated. Alright, so let's put them just like that. And his eyes do have that kind of light piping effect, which I bet if we put them right in the sun, it might show up a little bit better. It certainly does in real life. I'm not sure if it translates on camera. Let's see. Yeah, it totally does. That's really cool. All right, very good. Well, let's give him a one clenched fist. Let's see how that looks. It looks like these bracers are separate pieces, but I feel like they're glued on. All right, there we go. So here comes Eternia's firefighter, ready to blast some snake men, the horde, 
Skeletor's evil minions. And he came out really cool. Um, let's see, it looks like the, uh, oh yeah, the ears are articulated too. So the ears do go forward and backwards. Head gives you uh, up and down, full rotation, side bending. Uh, the shoulders can go up, you know, full 90 degrees. And rotate all the way back. Now these the shoulder harnesses or the shoulder pads here do restrict it just a little bit. They've got uh, cut at the bicep, single jointed elbows that rotate and go forward and backwards. And then uh, obviously up and down on the wrist as well as rotation. Uh, these does have a torso cut and which he rotates and go side to side. Then these uh, are the new hips that kind of go up and down. And uh, yeah, I mean, this looks like, I mean, it probably uses the majority of the typical Masterverse buck, but I, I'm seeing a lot of new pieces, which is really cool. So uh, there we go. Man, Snout Spout, he came out great. Hopefully you guys have him in your collection. And I think he's a great addition. Looks like this uh, pressure gauge is also adjustable. But yeah, overall great figure. I actually had Snout Spout from the vintage line as a kid. It was one of my favorite characters but I was not able to pick him up in classics. Um, I think I have the Origins version, but uh, I mean, this is just hands down. Like you can't even compare the two. They're just so different. But uh, anyway, so that was my review on the Masterverse Snout Spout. Hope you guys are having a good day. Uh, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. And uh, I've got some more stuff coming up. I've got a bunch of master of the universe stuff that I, I still need to unbox so just hang tight be patient with me and i'll see you guys next time bye